We are back in. It's Super Bowl weekend. Golf Talk Radio with Mike and Billy. And what would be better, more better than uh, a live shot of the day on Super Bowl? Yeah, you know what? This is going to be cool. I got my one of my oldest friends and best buddies ever. He's, he's like family. Um, Barry Deffer from the Berkshires of Massachusetts. You can call now, Barry. And uh, he's not listening, so he's going to call. <laughs> I, I thought he said. was because he said he's ready. He's called about. Um, we're going to call him Frying Pan B. That's his nickname on a golf course is Frying Pan B. And I really want you to, you'll understand when he hits some shots. Now, our job as golf professionals is we listen to the shot that's hit. Oh, he's met, hitting multiples. He's, well, again, I hope he has more than one golf ball with him. Nice. Because Mike is like 83 out of 91 correct on what the ball flight does because he's just magic. He can hear it and know it. <laughs> I'm about 50%. So we call the shot after it's hit. We can tell, you know, what the you know, with the fl- ball flight. Uh, he'll tell us what club he's hitting. and hope he's hitting his driver. But um, we'll find out. So, but Mike, you're good at this. You almost always. I am. Yeah, you're very good at this. So oh, he was there and he's gone. Call back again. I'm on Barry. Oh, he's got a couple minutes anyway. Okay. So I, I, I haven't seen him in about. He came out to my wedding, and I think I might have seen him once since. And we've been married 25 years. But the three of us were together in Palm Springs a couple weeks ago. Haven't seen each other for 33 years. I think I talked about that last time we were on the radio. But uh, we got to play golf with him. He's so funny. He's a kindest man. He's a chef. It's one of the reasons we call him Frying Pan B. He's a great, I was going to ask you about uh, that. There's a couple reasons. You'll, but he is a chef. He's a great <laughs> chef. He works yeah. at an amazing um, kind of a retreat for the elite. Yeah. In, in uh in I want to say Lenox, Massachusetts. Um I might I think it is Lenox, but it's what you know, it's for the for the one percenters. He goes, you know, he does he's wow. got a really nice retreat place. Um he's the kindest man on the planet. He has you know, he's he's just a funny boy, is he funny? And after we played golf, I said, You gotta call the show and hit a shot for us because his shots are unique. I can promise you that. I can't wait to hear it. You so, know, the, the history of our live shot of the day after, you know, been on the air for 20 years. I mean, we used to do, we used to do it weekly. Yeah. And we had our good friend, Tim Lane, who would, who would do it. And, and Kyle Miller, remember he did had, it. They all had characters. Yeah. So Beef Wellington. Beef Wellington. Kyle was Akbar. Yeah. And that stopped when the war broke out. Kermit the Frog Kermit, called and in. And Kermit call, called in. And Squ- SpongeBob SquarePants. Yeah. No, SpongeBob Square, Square Grooves. grooves. <laughs> Plum Bob Square Grooves. Yes. That was one of our characters. So we're going to go to the lines immediately to one of my best friends of all time. I believe he's on the line. Mr. Barry Deffer, are you with us, Barry? I am. Hey, man, it's so good to have you on our show, buddy. But I, the reason I asked you if you were listening when I text you is because I've been bragging about you and talking to you about you a lot. So um, <laughs> here's how it works. Uh, by the way, this is Barry Deffer, uh, one of my oldest friends ever and closest buddies of all time, uh, also known as Frying Pan B. He is a, <laughs> he, he is a chef. And uh, avid golfer, and I have the pleasure of seeing him again. And I've been twenty plus years since we got together, and I saw him in Palm Springs a couple weeks ago. Greatest three days ever. Um, he's a good cribbage player. I think he cheats, but I can't prove that. Um, <laughs> but, and he has a great sister. And he's is that you, Rana? Yes. Hi, Rana. How are you? Good. How are you? He does have a great sister. I'm fine, Rana. Thank you for asking. <laughs> so, um, Barry, here's how this works. You're going to put your phone as close as you can to the golf ball, so don't just so you don't hit your phone because we need to hear the sound, okay? So, yeah. and you're going to describe what are you hitting your driver? Yes. Okay. So after you hit the, the frying sound, pan, the frying pan. After you hit the <laughs> shot, Mike and I will describe the flight of the ball because we are so good. Mike, Mike, say hi to Barry, by the way. Hi, Barry. And Rana. Hi, Mike. Hi, Rana. So, um, hi. Are you guys? So we're ready when you are. Don't hit your phone. We've had it happen. <laughs> Yeah. Guy Listen, his, I'm not going to be able. I'm not going to be able to describe the flight because I'm hitting to a net. Well, we're, you just you spoiled it, man. That's what I was going to call. Mike was going to say you hit a big fade or something, and I was going to call it. Net. <laughs> Dang it! Well, I I'll had see you, you in a network. I though. had you beat, but we still know how the ball would fly. We know. Yeah, we're that good. <laughs> I, I could guarantee you. I pretty much know your ball flight. But are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> So you got to hear the sound. This is this is his favorite club. He he, he flew this club all the way across country to just so you had it. So where where are you at right now, Barry? I'm in uh, Great Barrington, Massachusetts. Oh, nice across the country live shot. Man, this is our longest live shot. Wow. Well, we had one from Europe or something one time. I think yeah, <laughs> yeah, we did. Somebody, Linnell, somebody I think. Call, yeah, Jeff from England. Yeah. yeah. So this is yeah. So this is going to be a good shot, buddy. You might hit two for <laughs> us. Okay. So do you have two golf balls there? Oh, yeah, I got three. All right. Cool. Because nice. the sound is something well, you all... Rob's going to hold, gonna hold the phone. Oh, uh, we put it right down. It has to be really close to the ball so we can hear the, the like whole impact the and, the, and everything. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. This is Barry Deffer, everybody. Live shot of the day. Best radio ever.
Wow. Got to get a little closer. Did you get that? <laughs> Got to get a little closer, Ron. I mean, don't, don't hurt yourself. But yeah, we heard okay. it. We heard a little bit. It was a little on the heel. There was a little low cut. It was a little on the heel. What do you call? <laughs> was it? I, I think it was. What do you think, Mike? I think he hit it low on the heel. I think he towed it. <laughs> how'd, how'd you hit that one, Barry? Oh, there it was. That was center. That was good. That was Topped a, it. Topped it. <laughs> center top. All right, one more. Take deep breath. Get the phone as close as you can. Here we go. I'm, I can't wait. Pop up. Pop yeah. up or a top? That almost missed. That almost missed the net. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, buddy. It was how did how'd you hit that one? Are you there? I'm here. How did you hit that one? Pretty well. Uh, I think I hit it well. Okay. The the the, the one thing that the 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 Valley of Palm Springs echoes. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. It, it sounds kind of dull right yeah. here. Yeah. Because it sounds kind of cold. If you hit a, a, fr cold. a frying yeah. pan with degrees. A, oh yeah, so yeah so look, that'll do it. That'll do it. Um, his his driver sounds just like a frying pan if you hit, if you whacked it with a spoon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. In fact, I've used that. Uh, yeah. to Describe that to other people. So, what is what's the driver you have? What is the brand? It's a Slazenger. Oh my gosh, <laughs> he has Slazenger. Yeah, he, had, he brought his irons that he had from he got from the mid '80s with him. <laughs> Slozenger is near and dear to my heart. I know man. you are. That's right. You oh, are a Slozenger guy, golf ball guy. <laughs> Love the Slozenger. Well, well, I love well, the Slaz. The Slaz. Frying the pan. Be Barry Deffer from Great Barrington, Massachusetts, with the live shots of the day. Nice drives, buddy. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> I'll talk to you. Fifteen two, fifteen four, <laughs> pair of six. Yeah. <laughs> Nineteen. Nineteen. <laughs> I'll t uh, I will send you the link, or you could go check the podcast later this evening, if not tonight, tomorrow. All right. Awesome. Thanks for your time. Thanks, Thank you, Barry. Thank See you, you Rana. Bye. You Bye. 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 All right. That, that was, uh, live that was too cool, man. So it, the sound of his, if you had a frying pan, and went, Dook! <laughs> it's just like that. And it's so funny. We were at the house here at, had frying pans. And so after we played, I went over there, got a frying pan out, and Dook! hit it with the, and Steve, I was a friend. Starts cracking up because it's exactly what his driver sounds like. And he hits some pretty good shots. He loves that club. He drives it pretty well, man. I'll tell you. The so. Slozenger. That, uh, gosh, that's mind blowing. That is, yeah. That's so long ago. <clears throat> that's just crazy. <laughs> it had, you know, when they first came out, they had the, the, the hollow sounds, like even the, the, the Bertha, the big Bertha came out and had a tink. It was just a weird sound before they filled all the heads with foam oh, and all that. Oh, yeah. So it, it was, it just had one of those original old sounds that, and with a harder golf ball these days, <laughs> pretty, pretty funny. But anyways, that was cool. Thank you, Barry Deffer from the Berkshires. Of I might have another Frank Pan B. Um, I might have another live shot. Oh, cool. Like right now. Really? Yeah. Rick from Cow Camp just texted me. Nice. One of the one of our early, early listeners um, <laughs> from Cow said, Camp. hey, Mike. Uh, hi, Mike. Rick from Cow Camp here. I'm listening live. You guys are still sounding great. And I just text him, say, hey, are you available? Can you hit a live shot of the day? Because I think he lives out on the ranch. He does. He's hit a lot of shots into the pasture. Yeah. So we've got him into the nets in the Berkshires. 30, it's wintertime, obviously, in Massachusetts. Yeah. I'm surprised it's that warm because I thought it was. That's be. pretty cold, dude. But his, uh, his yeah. brother-in-law, Ron, is his sister, her husband, and they have a net, I believe. I don't know where in their house, if it's in the house or outside, but he said he could hit a shot for me. Um, Barry and I used to play a lot of golf together. So uh, That's really cool. Back a lot of memories and... And uh, I've I'm, had a couple I'm hoping to uh, play one more round with him before the end of this year. Good, you should, man. I want. I still want you to hit your driver. I will. I promise you. Mike was kind enough to give me a driver for my 60th birthday. It's brand new ping. It's beautiful. I just have a lot going on, and no, oh. not not really excuses, just facts. But I look at it every day. And somebody asked me. I said, Mike, Mike gave me a new driver ping. It's awesome. He said, What kind of ping? I'm like, um, Well, it's a G. G400. <laughs> G four hundred max. So I couldn't even answer the question. That's Rick, Rick can't do it. He lives in Coarse Gold now. He doesn't have the oh. ranch anymore. Come on, Rick. But any Rick, way, Rick. Uh, thanks for texting us. Well, we'll try to get more live shots today. If we get them live on a golf course, it's pretty fun because you can actually That's really... you know, hear the ball fly and stuff. So, um, we can, we have history. I heard right. Uh, we What's do. We in? should. <laughs> we we need we we can do. Uh, Maybe what we do is we can we can round out with history. Okay, you want to do so? You want to? You we can Super come Bowl back with stuff. Super Bowl prop bets. Oh, so. you mean round out now? 
Like, well, we can we can take a break, come <laughs> back with Super Bowl prop bets, and then do history. Okay, sounds great. Does that sound cool? Yeah. Okay. All right, so we'll take our first break of the first hour. It's Golf Talk Radio with Mike and Billy, uh, brought to you by bestholeinone.com. Check out bestholeinone.com for prize packages for hole-in-one contests. Uh, choose your prizes that you want, cash, cars, unique travel options. Hey, Joe Cox. Remember Joe Cox? I Lefty? do. He aced, I saw that. He aced hole number six at Paso yesterday. It's like his 10th one or something. Yes. Said. How many you got? Lefty. He's a lefty. So uh, if, yeah, if good Joe, for him, if, he's always yeah, been a player. If Joe had had joined Best Hole in One's insurance program for seventy five bucks, he would have won twenty five hundred for that hole. In Joe. One so if you guys around the world listening want to want to sign up for a membership, bestholeinone dot com, pay seventy five bucks for the year. You hit hole in one, it's twenty five hundred bucks. Man, Playing with your buddies, that's a no brainer. You could you could yeah. join up not just through Paso, anywhere you just go anywhere, online. Just go online, bestholeinone dot com. I got it. Well, uh, we're pros. Probably doesn't count. Tell them Golf Talk Radio sent you. Yeah, we can't. We, they so, won't Claire, my little Claire, Yeah, she had one, too, last week. Nice. <laughs> Where at? Third. Uh, I want to say the sixth hole at Rancho Maria. Oh. But I, I, I think that's it's a, the sixth hole. She wow, texted, that's a good hole. She texted. She, that's a good hole in one. That's a tough par she three. Hit, she hit hybrid. I have her text. Yeah, that's a tough par three, man. So uh, Really tough Just got a hole one on my, th- it was my third show, hole in three. Ah. <laughs> uh. Um, shot at the sixth at Rancho, so I think I don't know what happened to her first shot, but she had her second one for the. Well, team. it's easy. Barry's had a hole in three. I was well, he had a hole in three once. <laughs> it's easy. I think there's a if you hit it off to the left side, it yeah. can go out of bounds. Yeah, I, I believe so. Forever. It's been a long time. All right, we'll be right back, guys. Stay with us. Golf talk radio with Mike Millie. We're going to come back with Super Bowl prop bets with the help of Hop. Right, Hop. Hop props. All right, yeah, man. We'll be right back. The Stay Hop props us. coming up. Hi, I'm.